Hello everyone. Today I am going to implement safe image generator of IRS data sector using GAN. So GAN is a generative adversarial network that is a that is an uh, unsupervised learning task in machine learning that invoke automatically discovering and learning the regularities or pattern in the input data in such a way that uh, model can be used to generate a new output. So GAN consist two models first is generator model that uh, that is uh, generate a new output and the second one is a discriminator model that is try to classify that uh, the output an output is fake or real so uh, in this model i'm going to tell uh, tell the steps so first step is uh, load our data set and uh, import some required libraries and second step is define the discriminator network and third step is uh, de define a generator network and uh, fourth step is define loss optimizer and helper function for training and the last step is uh, train our model. So starting with the first step, uh, here you can see uh, uh, I'm, lo uh, I'm loading the data set and uh, import some module and import some libraries. So in the next step, I'm transforming the pixel values uh, from the range of 0 to 1 to a next range of minus 1 to 1 the reason of for doing this will be uh, will become clear when I define the generator network so uh, let move to the next step uh, uh, here uh, I here I create a uh, downloader to load the data set in batches. You can see uh, here I'm uh, I'm importing the data loader uh, from uh, from dot dot utils dot data to uh, load the data in uh, our device, uh, whether device is GPU or CPU. So and also create a device uh, let us look uh, here uh, also create a device that uh, that can be used to move uh, move our data to the module of uh, gpu uh, if present otherwise cpu uh, in the next step uh, uh, we define a discriminator network the discriminator network uh, takes an input as in uh, uh, takes an image as input and try to uh, classify that it is real or fake. Uh, in this sense, it like uh, any other ne neural network. While we can use a CNN for discriminator, I am using a simple feed forward network with three layer. Let us look. Uh, here you can see uh, I am using three layers or uh, three linear layer and I am using a uh, really uh, leaky uh, relu for activation or uh, activation function of discriminator. So uh, in next step uh, I am defining a generator network. Uh, the input of generator network is typely, uh, uh, typely a vector or a matrix which is used to see it for generating an image. Uh, once again, to keep the thing simple, we will uh, use a feed forward, feed forward neural network with five layer. Here you can see uh, I'm using one, two, three, four and five uh, neural network and uh, activation function relus and uh, uh, other activation function T, A and H uh, uh, it will uh, 
it lies the range of minus 1 to 1 and uh, next step uh, I, I have defined a discriminator training for and helper function to reset the gradient and uh, train the uh, train the discriminator so in this step uh, uh, i am extract the discriminator to the output uh, uh, output one if image is real and uh, uh, zero if image was generated so uh, after that, I passed the batch of real images and compared the loss and settings the target level to the one. Then uh, generate a batch of uh, fake images using generator and pass them into the discriminator to compute the loss, uh, loss and settings uh, uh, setting the target to the level zero. And finally, add, add the two losses and use the uh, overall losses to perform the gradient descent and uh, adjust the weight of a discriminator. So, in next step, uh, I am going. Uh, I define a generator uh, generator training. Uh, since uh, the output of the generator uh, generator are images, so it. So not obvious how to train the generator. It is where I employ the rather uh, elegant trick, which is used to discriminator as a part of loss function. So in this, uh, in this, uh, I am going to uh, generate a batch of image using the uh, generator and pass to uh, pass into the discriminator and uh, after that we calculate the loss by setting the target values one if it is real uh, we do this because the generator uh, objective is to fool the discriminator it always uh, try to uh, disc uh, try to discriminator fool and uh, next step we uh, use the loss uh, loss to perform gradient uh, by changing the weight uh, of the generator so that uh, uh, gener generated image look like uh, real images uh, in next step uh, i am going to train our model so First of all, uh, uh, create a directory where I uh, save the intermediate outputs, uh, which can be generated by our generator. So uh, here you can see uh, I am going to define a path. Uh, let us see. Uh, here uh, I define a path. If a, a sample, if sample exists then uh, if uh, if sample path uh, does not exist then it uh, make a new sample path so uh, here you can see i am saving the uh, real uh, batch of uh, real images in the sample path after that uh, define a helper function to save uh, save the batch of generator image of the uh, end of every pool so here you can see uh, i'm uh, saving the first uh, fake images look like uh, this uh, that is not a good generator so uh, here uh, define a helper function to save the batch of generated image to the disk at the end of every epoch i used to fix a set of uh, input vectors to the generator to see how the individual uh, generator image evolve over the time as i train the model so now we're ready to train our model uh, here you can see in every pose i 
I train the discriminator first, then the uh, generator. The training might be take a while if uh, you are not reaching a GPU CUDA. So here you can see in every approach, uh, after every approach, we uh, save the uh, image in our created directory samples. So it might uh, take uh, some time whether you uh, if you did not using uh, CPU uh, GPU device. So after uh, generating a, a lot of images, uh, we simply look look the outputs output. So here you can see uh, uh, our first output it look like this and after uh, uh, generating 14 images we look uh, the image look like this uh, we can see the uh, uh, not a clear image but uh, some improvement are there and uh, here you can see uh, more improvement or uh, after create uh, generating some image of uh, some images and uh, uh, here you can see also see a clear more more clear so the thing is uh, uh, when i change the learning rate and uh, 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 change the approach, num approach number so it uh, it will generate our better and better images so uh, here i am plotting the loss loss of uh, 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 loss of discriminator and generator in every coach and the next step uh, I am plotting a, a score of real uh, real image and fake image in every coach so that is all for today thank you